I'm Portia, and this is my very first video. Um, I'm going to tell you a little bit about myself. I'm 11 years old, and I have been looming for, I think, a few months now. But in this video, I'm going to be teaching you how to make these adorable butterfly charms. So what you need to do is you need to make these little things. So what you're going to do is you're going to grab, I'm just going to show you once, okay? So if you need to look back, that's totally fine. So I'm going to be using pink and green. So you're going to take one single band, pull, twist, back on, and then pull, back on, okay? So you have three loops. So you're just looping around your hook three times. But if you're not familiar with this, that this can be a little bit hard. Um, when I, I know when I first started, it was kind of difficult. So now you're just going to take, oh, sorry, I forgot to show you. Um, two single bands, like this. And hold them on your hook like this. This is my plastic hook. My metal hook is full right now. Because um, I'm making, I already have all of our like butterfly wings pre-made. So the video doesn't have to be too long. Okay, so you're going to pull those three loops on, okay? And then you're just going to do that. And um, so pause the video and you have to do this three more times, okay? So... Um, now that I'm done my four times, I'm going to grab, um, um, I'm going to grab one band, one single band, and I'm going to put it around my hook three times, so like you did for the outer of your butterfly wing, okay? And you have to make four butterfly wings. But you only have to make one antenna. You have to use scissors. Scissors. These ones are just for my kitchen. They're just everyday kitchen scissors, okay? So if you're wondering. Okay, now I'm going to take two more black. One, two, two black, two black, yay! Okay, then you're going to take I find it too easy or to do it one at a time, okay? So you're going to do one, pull it on, bring back down, okay? And you're going to make a slip knot with this one. Make a slip knot. See, like this, just make an everyday slip knot. Nothing fancy about this slip knot. Just putting it onto those three bands. My head is all messed up. I'm going to do this again, just to show you. And because I messed up, <laughs> so you will have to wrap, wrap it around your hook three times, three times, okay? Then you're going to grab one single band. And it helps to make them all even here. So my bottom one is super tight, my top one's loose, so I can just pull them to make it even like this, okay? Now I'm going to pull, like this, with one band. Urch! Now they're on. You're going to slowly, so it doesn't make it like all twisted. Put it on like this, okay? Now you can, before making your slip knot, I'm so sorry last time, I just, yeah. it, you should see the little hole. See? I'm going to look through it. See? Ooh. Ah! Sorry, that was my bird Bentley, if you want to see him. He's super cute. This is Bentley. Hi, pretty boy. So if you hear, like, tweeting in my videos, that would be that. Oh, sorry. It's on my step now. Okay, here we go. So now, so it should look like this. The single band is holding the bands looped around three times, okay? So with that single band, you are just going to loop it. No, you're not going to loop it. I'm sorry. You're going to make a slip knot, so just keep pulling. That quick. Okay? Then you're going to put your hook back in that um, band where you put looped it three times. Grab one more band. Pull it. Pull this thing on. Don't know what to call it. Maybe half an antenna. I don't know. And then you're just going to go like this. Put it back on. Okay? So now that you've done that, you can just leave this to the side. Make sure it doesn't fall apart. Fall apart. I'm so sorry. I can't talk today. Can't talk any day. But today is especially bad. 
Okay, I don't remember how to do this. So, let me look. One sec. That is a slip mount. Okay, never mind. I'm sorry. So what you ha actually have to do is with that band that you just put on, it's not a slip knot, but you need to make it a slip knot. So just pull the other band over it, slowly pull. So it, otherwise it makes it all scrunched up. And then you have to fix it. I fixed it, okay? So then you have your th four loops. Well, you Hurry should. Up, Dad. Jed, quiet, I'm doing a video. That's my brother, he's not that shy. <laughs> okay, so now you're going to just put that end of that slip knot, one end, it doesn't matter which end, on to your hook, like this. Okay. And then pull, 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 until that back band. Then you're going to do this, and the, you do not want to put it back on this circle band. You want to put it right before the circle band. Right here. So, opening it up here right below. It's a whole different band, okay? So it should look like this now. Back it up a little bit. And then now you can just fix your little things. It's easier to fix it now because then when it's in because it's all tight, it's hard to move it. So now what you're going to do is you're going to take the single end that's closest to the end of your hook. You're going to bring that up and over, over that other band. So you're just going to take it off your hook entirely. Okay, so it should look like this now. Now that you made another slip knot there. Now it kind of looks like really messed up. It has a really long neck. See? It's e and then what you can do is you can just spread the wings apart. And now you have the slip knot on the top of its head. You can just take your scissors. Be careful with your scissors. You don't want to get cut. So you go like this. And chop. Dad, let the camera see you. That's my brother, Jed. He's a little sneaky. He's stealing a little bar. Yes. So this is how you make this super duper duper easy um, butterfly charm. I'm going to name it, but you can pick the name and you just write the name that you want me to name this little butterfly in the description box below. And then I will name it whatever you say. Okay? So... Thank you for watching my tutorial, how to make um, a butterfly charm. In my next video, I'm going to be showing you how to make this flower charm. Um, it's either a flower charm or it can be um, a snowflake, depending on what colors you do. So, see you next time. Bye!